during my PhD, I studied vertebra development. At vertebra has different sections like cervical vertebra, thoracic vertebra with ribs, and lumbar vertebra in the belly and other parts. The identity of these vertebral parts are given by a certain group of genes called Hox genes. Uh, they sit in the genome like back to back in clusters and depending on where they are activated, uh, they give identity of that certain uh, part of vertebra. For, for the case of my PhD, I work with Hox10 group. They are the determinant of lumbar vertebra. They function by uh, repressing the uh, thoracic cord and uh, they uh, block the rib formation and uh, I identified two parts of this protein which uh, is important for its rib removal function and when I took out these uh, parts from Hox10, it loses its function and uh, are not able to uh, block uh, thoracic program and uh, the lumbar vertebra turns into the thoracic one. Small ribs start growing in the um, belly part of the vertebra. And when I put these pieces into another protein which doesn't have at all rib removing, rib blocking activity, I see that this protein gained a rib blocking function. And uh, we see vertebra forming without any ribs. In the end we found that uh, these two elements are responsible for the rib removal function of Hoxton group of proteins.